What's going on, Nitro gang? Happy Nitro Sunday. I mean, Saturday. Is that today? Yeah, Saturday. Saturday. Okay. Yeah. All right, everybody. We're going to wait a little while for you uh, to all show up. This is probably one of the last opportunities we'll have with, uh, you know, no crazy wind. We got a special guest host today. We got Brian. What's, What's your on? YouTube username? Boosted RC. Boosted RC. Used to be Boosted Baja, right? Yeah. It's too long. It. It's too long. It was People a pain in the butt. It out. Yeah. So we shortened we got, it a little bit. <laughs> we got Bob's RC. How you doing, man? What's going on, Bob's? All right. You guys let me know how the audio is and um, we'll continue. So probably going to be maybe like about an hour live. Not not like the longest. I'm limited by Arma uh, phone battery yeah. technology. Yeah. You know, we got Nitro Gang Queen Melissa over here. How you doing? She's guys. a track support expert here today. Uh, <laughs> Sam S. How you doing? Earl Moorhead is here. What's up, Earl? All right. Uh, you guys can hear Brian when he's talking. I just want to make sure because, like, since we're standing on different sides of the recording device, it's a little different, the audio sometimes. Yeah. I think, right? Yeah. You guys hear me okay? Yeah, just uh, tell us if you hear him. Okay, audio is good. Go, Sam. That's okay. Sickening, sickening. All right. All right, man. So um, you brought a couple nitros. I brought a couple nitros. I invited a couple people, but it looks like, dude, where, where are they? I don't know. I don't know Did where they know? are. Did they wake up today? Did they drink too much? I don't know. Could be Arma Day. It but, could be you know, an Arma Day. We push them away. We got all nitro here. Maybe they're good. all charging light bulbs right now. It could be. Sickening. I actually did that before I came here for the electric start. <laughs> it's all good. <laughs> all right. Okay, guys. Let's go over uh, what we have. Now, uh, Brian over here brought us his newest project that he's been working on. Uh, Savage. This is the original 25 chassis. Yep. With What's up, Alan, man? How you doing? Sorry if I'm not giving you guys a little shout out, but, you know, um, Feel free to chat. I'm happy you're all here. We got the Ofna Pico 26, and it's got good compression. Excellent compression. Excellent compression. You was, rebuilt this? Yeah, it was a pain in the butt. I actually had a buddy of mine from uh, Italy actually send me some stuff for the for the back plate. Oh, okay, and, yeah. And but those are hard to get parts. And we're good. Those are hard to get we're parts, good. man. So yeah. we just got to do a little bit of tuning, and I think we'll lock it in. I see we got, oh, man. These are, like, probably the only smooth integer shocks I've ever felt. How, how did this happen? What weight shock wheel did you use? Uh, 60. 60, okay. That's not bad. Yeah, suspension is smooth. So I think today we're going to uh, probably the first fire on this, huh? Yeah, oh, compression is sickening. Okay. Uh, how you doing there, RC Nitro? We got a Jado. You never Jado. leave home without a Jado. No. And Love for it. me, for me, guys, for me, I didn't want to leave home without, uh, you, you remember this right here? This is the John Deere Revo. You can mow a lawn, you could sow some grass. I think that's the term they use, right? For planting seeds, sowing? I think so. Sow? So I don't know, I'm not a farmer. Uh, I'm, a, I'm like an auditor in real life, you know, it's not even related. Um, you know, so none of us farm. We live in New York City. The closest I came to farming is like, remember that game Farmville? That's it. Farmville, bro, Farmville. Melissa, you play Farmville? No. What level you get to? Not high enough because they make you pay for it. Yeah, Sick of it. All right, so this is the older uh, Revo with the 3.3. There are a couple videos on it. Uh, I will try to fire this one up, guys, in a little bit. I haven't started it in like over maybe two years now. So if something is dead, well, something is dead. You know what I'm saying? But we're never going to pull out an Arma to compensate for being dead. That's never going to happen. We're going to pull out more Ar more Revos. Okay. All right. Sickening. Jeremy Stone goes love it. All right. Hi, let's. Jeremy. All right, Melissa says hello to everybody. Sorry for cutting you off over there, Melissa. How you doing? All right. Melissa, why are you so short for? Sickening. Bri oh, Brian's the tallest one out of all of us. <laughs> Trust me, okay? Trust me. Hey, hey, we do it. All right. All right, my guys. Um, I think we're gonna probably work work on on the on the savage, yeah. Probably first one. That that's gonna, gonna be the toughest, the tough toughest competition I think for us to uh yep. to deal with. I got that and a rustler. I'm still working on. But worst case scenario, yeah. Jado fires right. Bro, up. let's check out the bag of RCs you brought, because I think people people need to really understand. Right. Uh, you don't play around. No, I don't. So we're gonna check out Brian's sickening RC bags. So this is the rustler I just redid. Oh yeah, this is the one you bought that was almost killed by the prior owner, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Sickening. And when you redo things, you literally take apart everything piece by piece. Everything. You don't play around. No. Is that how you normally repair Jaguars? You have to like disassemble everything to. down to the frame? That and the Range Rovers. Ra Range Rovers. You gotta tear them down. Yeah, Brian, he applies the Range Rover repair principle. Everything new. That's Kidding it. Around. <laughs> That's it. So. All right. Minus, yeah. the, minus the air filter. 
No? We're yeah. Good. Well, we could probably salvage it from something else. Yeah. But just to do a little test start, I don't think we need the air filter. No, nah. we're not going to be nah, running in good. sand today. So. We're good. So we got that one. All right. What else we got? We got the FW06. Oh, yeah. We ran this a little while ago. I just haven't edited that video. This is the kit that you bought that you built. Yep. Kyosho. Yeah. Me and DMY and you. Yeah, I still haven't uh, put mine together, I but that. I have the ready to run one. So for yeah. me, it's like kind of like, what am I going to, yep. you know, I did the RX-7 body. Very nice. Yep. So what's your all uh, overall impression? I love it. Of the kit. I love it. It's not bad, love right? It. The only thing I will say is usually kits are a little bit um, higher models, you know, mm -hmm. well, upgrades. This is literally like if you were to get the RTR versus the kit identical, yep. there's no 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 carbon fiber no it's it's no. just like kind of like an rtr that you put yourself without electronics yep. the only problem i have is the phillips screws yeah the phillips screws. care for yeah. it i should have bought the kit for the allen screws but you know what it's all good yeah it's all right loctite what you have to do and that's it yeah all right <clears throat> next up next one is rs4 beamer oh yeah we got a Pick. lot of beam W fans in this, in this I, chat, I think. Yeah, I picked this one up on the cheap. I picked oh, it up for thanks about... Thanks for that donation from Alan Patterson. He goes, gotta love Nitro. Well, Alan we do. Patterson? We do. Thank we you, love Alan. It. I think Brian loves him more than me because he, he came with more Nitros. Sick. <laughs> Dude, how far did you drive? I, I want people Two to hours. know you're dedicated. Two hours. Two hours. Sick Two hours. Is traffic? Lauren. Oh, we just got a message from Dan Y. How you doing? Dan Y, unfortunately, can't make it here today. I wish he could. But he's out there making those nitro funds, bro. But don't worry, guys. You guys are going to see Dan Y in a little while. Okay. Sickening. Here we go. So that's it. Oh, yeah. This is the recent one you just got. Yep. $120. Facebook Marketplace. Oh, wow. You know what's so annoying on these older style... Well, I don't want to say older. These carbs, they use like really small um, filter openings. Yeah. You know what I mean? Yep. You have to kind of get these like... Not very good filters because you could see, mm -hmm. like the sponge material is yeah. super super coarse. Yeah, it I is coarser than like so salt. Yep. Yeah, so uh, RS43, my my favorite one. Mm -hmm. Oh wow, you have the aluminum upper deck here. Yep. Uh, well, this is not called upper deck. It's a support. support. Some kind of support. Yeah. Support. All front is aluminum. What's up, Melissa? No, I'm just saying suction. Yeah. Okay. Really smooth dips over here. Mm -hmm. I think this was originally the last generation one before they got cut. You know how I know? Orange shot caps. Mm -hmm. The last ones had the orange shot caps. Yep. G3.0. No, this is the T3.0 actually. T3.0. Smoothest transmission I have. Yeah. Two speed, right? Yep. Did you check the shift points? Yes. Oh yeah. That's Fantastic. a two speed baby, everybody. Two speed baby. All right. We're going to fire this one up in a little bit. Absolutely. Brian, this is this your first like uh, generation of this chassis? Yeah. Yeah, Didn't one. I tell you to, you got you, you got to get me, one? Look, look for one that in the Slayer that we have down here. Yeah, fantastic, fantastic, Love right, it. man? I really, Love it. you know how many videos I've made asking HPI to bring mm -hmm. this back, yep. and they bring back like nitros that like they can't even keep in stock. Yep. I think the Savage XL. I mean, people love the XL, but that's like a seven hundred dollar truck, you know. Yeah. People Stop. want the ten scales. Yep. Everybody in the chat, you want a ten scale? Well, you 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 can get one. Even these pipes are not bad. Oh, they're great. Oh, I see you've uh, adapted the HSP tank. Yes. That's genius. And top plate. Oh, I see. Oh, that's man, that's interesting. For everyone that's working on this one and you're like, oh, man, I need a fuel tank because these old HPI tanks are impossible to get. So I guess you can cut out the HSP upper mm -hmm. deck. Yep. What'd you do? Just zip tie? That's all you yeah. need. Sick. That's genius, man. It's genius. You gotta get what you gotta get. Yeah, exactly. That's a Roto Star one? Yeah. Yep. All right, and the last one. The last one. This one put me through hell. The Slayer. Sorry oh, for, dude, we did recorded like two videos with this. Where are we gonna fire it up? Nightmare, nightmare. So <laughs> I bought this on the marketplace, but went up all the way up to Springfield, Massachusetts. I got it. Came back. We ran around and around here on the track. Yeah, I remember. Was we had all the problems <clears throat> possible. Wasn't acting right. Went through it. I was talking with Mr. Uh, Dimitri over yeah. here trying to figure it out, tore the tranny apart, turned out I had a Revo tranny with the locker in it and a rear brake conversion in it. So I, I took all that and went to Jenny RC, got a stock tranny and we're good. And then we took it out once again and turned out that the slipper clutch was way, way, way loose and wouldn't move anywhere and now we're good. And the issue you had, I want people to know, 
um this had the center diff yeah it had the optional rebo yeah. center diff yeah at first i was like no bro there's no center diffs but yeah so you could have actually gotten a center differential yep. for the rebo for uh for like racing yeah um i wonder did i don't know maybe someone here in the chat knows the the revo platinum edition that was like the really high model of the revo all right although i don't think it came with the center diff that was optional i think so. yeah but anyways i was here spinning the rear wheels i'm like bro the front wheel's not spinning you're missing you're missing Something's a pin somewhere right. yeah. turns out it was a center diff yeah and it drove bad yeah right dude yeah. we couldn't even take a turn with it yeah the last the last corner yeah. coming around here yeah anyways yeah. the video on that will be like out uh you know sooner or later that was actually a couple a uh, couple weeks ago we recorded that but yep. this is a little bit fast forward in the future all right, so let's uh all right that's good i have that's good. Say for them. what do you have to say melissa Where's melissa gotta tell you something she wants to know where the likes at where's, where's the, the likes? likes give the likes or or well i'm not gonna do nothing because i'm not this a bully, is you know? a nature live yeah i travel two hours yeah yeah need some likes brian over here traveled Why? two freaking Why? hours Help us out. You guys? Oh, there's Marvin goes, he has the Slayer Pro. Sickening. And there's only 14 likes. Where's yeah, just likes? for kicks. How you doing? All right. So, guys, uh, let's let's all take a little vote. What so are we going to do? What are we going to do? Awesome all right. We got RC Benjamin here. Martinez here. How you doing? What's up, Ben? All right, Melissa says hello. Melissa, do you have a lot of coffee today? You're, you're more talkative than normal. <laughs> <laughs> What's going on? Uh, I'm having to yell over you right Rip now. Rip it. Sickening. <laughs> Melissa's having some this. energy. Sick. All right, um, Brian, bro, I think people, let, let's see what they say. Let's see what they say. Savage, uh, Jado, or the Revo John Deere Tractor Edition. You can't get this at the tractor supply store, so don't, don't go. Everyone's going to say the Jado. Don't Jado. go to the tractor supply store. I know everyone's going to say the Jado. I don't Am know. Right? People here love the, the Revo, the and they Deere. love the Savage. I don't know. I don't know. I think we have the Savage gang over here. Joshua, how you doing, man? Clayton RC is here with us. Texas Hill is here. He goes, hi, Nitro Gang. Okay, what's up? What's up, Texas, what's up Tex, bro? Texas, right. what's up, my guy? Earl Moorhead said he wants the Jado. I told you people want to see the Jado. And we got the John Deere request going on. I don't think it's as fast as uh, Earl's Jado. <laughs> yeah, I think yeah. Earl Moorhead has the fastest Jado out of all of us, so. probably. I think so. I think we want to see some speed runs with that. <laughs> Let's, um... We can try it. You're the guest today, so you can pick, man. I want Earl to pick. Okay. Brian said he wants Earl to pick. I think Earl's going to pick a Jado. I think I so. Totally I think that's pretty it's pretty obvious. Everyone Earl would pick it. an Arma. Actually, no. I mean an X-Max, which we don't have, unfortunately, today. Because <laughs> I think everybody likes the Jado. Yeah. All right. So we're going to wait for uh, Earl's pick over here. Earl pick. Yeah, Melissa told you to pick, bro. Pick. <laughs> pick. Which so one? we have the option of, of uh, these three right now. There's more. Oh, there's plenty more. This I one? also have some RCs in, in, in Melissa's World's Smallest Honda. Thanks. You're welcome. People Thanks. need to know. No, people don't need to know my car. I mean, that Honda HRV might be the World's Smallest Honda, but like the new lease rates on cars are going to be killer. My Even wife, on the, the world's car, worst cars. So. Yeah. Dude, she loves we're only paying like 250 a month for that that's one. It. And that's a sport. I mean, it's a little rough ride over there, yeah. but like, what are you going to do, you know? Dude, we got like a quote to report a newer HRV. Mm -hmm. It was like, like almost, like it was almost 500 for like legit a $28,000 car. And the guy was going to give me unreal. the, um, yeah, unreal. It's ridiculous. One for the Milano. Yeah. I could literally buy a Murano every half a year True. with a dead ECM like mine. Yeah. I was looking we're going to fix it though. I hope we're going to fix it, bro. Murano's been parked for like two weeks already car. looking all it. upset and shit. Please. People be asking me, oh, so you bought this car. How come you don't drive it? Sick of it. Okay, Earl Moorhead, thank you for that. He goes, Jado for me. All right. Yeah, we can do that. See? We can do it. We, do, we knew Earl Moorhead was going to pick a Jado. I told you. All right, Brian, what do we got today? The VP... VP30. Where'd I, you buy this? Uh, uh, local hobby store. A local hobby store. How much, how much for a gallon? I'm, I'm curious. $40. You know what? That's not bad at all. Not bad. Considering the old Bones Brew, you could have gotten, what was it? Three gallons, basically. Well, 12 quarts yeah, is three gallons. somewhere around there. Like 100... Yep. 15 or something so then i take what i do with this one because the oil's a little bit low yeah so what i do i get my clots from my baja and i add a little oh, bit yeah. to it um so it, it, i try to no, get dilute around, it yeah yeah about yeah. nine ten percent oil but nitros, the nitros love it i was checking out the bones brew website they have like a bunch of these race brand race fuels that you have no info about there's like the ryan lutz the whoever lutz over there uh but there's no like info on like how those uh you know fuels are different or right, anyways bro go ahead let me shut up we're gonna fire up the jado as per request today okay as per request so we're gonna yeah 
That's why you can't leave home without a Jado. Melissa, can you put the Revo uh, on the on the floor somewhere, please? Sorry. Yeah, we need to give Brian ample working space. He's our guest today. Al Casa, how you doing, man? By the way, I want to say uh, thank you all for joining. Everyone just coming by. We have a special uh, guest here with us today, Boosted RC. You see him in the streams. You see him on the roads, you know, <laughs> running rich and loud if you're right from his state. You know, <laughs> you see him buying RC sometimes. And uh, he came out here today, Staten Island to the RC track. It's it's a good day, not very windy. Best remote ever. Yeah, GT5. Love Dude, it. remember when I first met Love you, it. I told you to get that radio. Love it. I told everybody, Dan Y, Benjamin Martinez, literally everybody to get it. And about 50% of the people listened. Sick. That's good. All right. All right. Texas, Texas Hill says hello to you, bro. What's going on, Tex? What's up, Tex? Congra congrats on the rebuild. I'm happy. Glad that it's running good for you. Okay, let's, we got the Jado over here. All right, people saying video is blurry. Let me let me not shake too much, guys. Okay, I'm gonna set the camera down a little bit. Yeah, yeah, sorry, guys, I'm moving a little too much, and we're outside, so we might have like some uh, situations. Let me know if the video quality improves a little bit or not. Let's take a hold on. Let's let's do a little bit of a. Uh, of a break so i see you did the revo or what is it the jado brake flip mod yes absolutely i'm curious when you first got this did this jado have any brakes at all none none yeah, whatsoever none. you know I, I a few people have told me they purchased these brand new and the mm -hmm. brakes were okay i'm thinking as the brakes wear down mm -hmm. it's the brake block that is uh, actually wearing down i would think so because too. the disc itself looks okay in almost yeah. all of them yep i also have the carbon disc upgrade uh, I actually got two of them, so right now I'm just gonna leave it the way it is. Yeah, but it stops. It's good. Yeah, it stops. All right, guys, you let me know. Uh, quality is a little bit better, is so better, I'm guys? limited by you know. Unfortunately, Trump's not president. He didn't make 5G real. Kidding around, well, everybody. He has nothing to do with that. Okay. <laughs> well, hopefully he's the president this year. Yeah, man. Like uh, uh, about two weeks ago, there was a rally like right across the street over here. You guys will see a video. I brought a uh, an associated MGT to the rally. I was about to. All right, guys. In the meantime, yeah, yeah. Boost the Baja is all I'm gonna get this fired up. See what we can do. Let's prime this baby first. Oh, Only problem. Right, hold the on, bro. Hold on, bro. Oh yeah, hey, it's uh, it's <laughs> me. We're we're doing a live right now. I'm, you know, we're using uh, Melissa's phone. Yeah, yeah, yeah. She could, she, she could say hello to you though. Okay. Uh, yeah, yeah. Hey, mom. Don't talk too much now. No, I'm laughing. Limited battery. You're Brian. You got anyone to call? I'm kidding around. <laughs> okay. Sickening. <laughs> yes. Live calls, bro. Live calls. Yes. All right, we done. I need the phone for uh, GoPros. Yeah, people saying that's sure. a serious prime job. All right, All right. Bye. All right, we are we are back, everybody. Okay. We are back. I hope you enjoyed that phone call. <laughs> battery got killing in, killing in the battery gang. All right. Yeah. Texas answer. Hill said it was President Trump calling. <laughs> Sick of it. Okay. Um. Let's see. Are we okay with the? Yeah. All right. Oh man. There's a little brat. I got a. That was a good start right there. Too rich, you know. It's okay. We're gonna let it chill for a little bit. 
Um, Earl Moorhead goes, Jado, fires up every yeah. time. Okay. It's alive. It's alive, those Quantos. Okay, <laughs> let's uh, let's let it chill. That was just a little uh, first start. We're going to run uh, all of this a little later. You know, I don't okay. know how long this live will be, but I did bring the GoPro. So we'll get some good action. All right. Yeah, we need to uh, glue those tires, you know? Yeah. But it's okay. Yeah, the inside, the outside. You just recently worked on this anyway, so you haven't actually did a road test, I think, with no, it? No, no, yeah. not really. Yeah, so there's still some, uh, as they down. say, growing pains. Yep. Wasn't that a sitcom? That was a sitcom, yeah, I think. Yeah, Growing pains, yeah. Dude, did you hear recently that guy from that 70s show got uh, 30 years for, for like, rape? Wow. That actor, Daniel, Daniel Masterson. Hey, you know. The guy that, uh, what was his name? From that 70s show, that one that always wore the dark glasses? Mm hmm 30 oh, years. Know. For a rape of two women. That's crazy. I mean, that's a bad crime, but you can't believe he got caught th this late, you know? He's the one that worked at the photography shop with the chief. Is he? I think so. Wow. Maybe I got the wrong place. You want a donut, bro? I'm good for oh, now. Okay. Tim Hortons. Yeah, it's our favorite. I had to wait like in a 12 minute line to get the donuts, bro. Oh, we got Phoenix. Oh, Gary here. How are you? Sickening. Uh, who, who wants a donut? Uh, you know what? I'm going to take. You want to give me half that chocolate one? All right, bro. Um, so the Jado's okay. We did, did yeah. a little uh, little test. Okay. All right. Yeah, Earl Mohar Ghost thought he got 10 years. Yeah, it's uh, he got 30 years, that guy. Yeah, 30 years. You know, sickening, sickening. All these actors with these terrible crimes they're doing, man. I don't understand. People love that guy. He didn't have to rape nobody. Hey, but play you your know, pay. Yeah. All right, man. Let's, um, I think you want to do this one? You pick, you pick. You we'll pick, try Brian. This. What, what is the most uh, situation nitro we got right now? I got I got the P, the Pico Savage, and then I got the Rustler uh, 25. How you doing there, RC Hobbies? Uh, happy so. to see, have you here, bro. So the Pico, let's, what do you guys think? We got two. We got two options. This one has never really been fired up, I think. Um, real, real, you just rebuilt this one. Yeah, real quick. And again, I got parts from Italy that came over. And nice. then um, I got it fired up a little bit. Got the infamous uh, blister between the two fingers for the pull Oh, start. man, I, I know all about that. And then um, I rebuilt the carburetor. And that's where we are. We're here now. Okay. So, Any other nitros for first start today, you think? Well, who's that? Just someone learning to drive in the parking lot? Probably. <laughs> Sickening. Ford Edge. RS4 starts up good. I wish the Ford Edge wasn't such a piece of crap. Yeah. I would buy it. Not a bad car. I like them. Yeah. Why they gotta make them so bad, bro? Yeah. Pissing me off. All right. Let's, um, I think it's savage time, right? We'll try it. No. Yeah, no guarantees. You never know. The same like plugging in the lipo battery. <laughs> Usually they don't go on fire, but sometimes they go on fire in your house, you know, and then, then the fire department comes over. Luckily, never happened to me. I keep mine in a lipo fireproof gun safe. Okay, guns not allowed in New York City, but like you know, we we put batteries in them. It's illegal. Well, I mean they are allowed, but you gotta pay like a shit ton of money, you know, like no, for for the permits. You have to have a permit for it first. I think owning a gun here in New York City is probably more expensive than fixing my Nissan Murano. <laughs> so, you know, unfortunately, that's we're gonna get that fixed though. Yeah, man, I think I'm going to have to do like an eBay ECM rebuild company, like a repair to send it out and we'll see. But then, even then, you still got to program the key. So I'm still yeah. going to have to call like a programmer. How you doing there, Lawman RC? All right, we got electronics on everything. Yeah. Let, me, let me check. Yep. I always like to Give check. Okay. Oh, man, that's some good feeling. Yeah, I did some uh, Amazon. 20 kg or something? Yeah. Yeah, I got two of them. You got the kg gang. All right. Let's, uh, uh, did we prime it? Let's prime it. Let's see. I see you got a nice clear track skew lines. Yeah, unfortunately. Uh, I have a glow plug tool if you want to like remove it a little. Okay, I don't know if I see fuel. Do I see fuel? Let me check. Unfortunately, it's clear. I think so. I see it. Oh, yeah. It's freaking clear fuel. Sickening. Oh. I think I think you got it. All right. Let's see what we can do. All right. I'm going to hold this. I got a heater. You want to preheat it? Uh. Let's preheat it. I think it's going to fire up. Uh, Melissa, can you go in my bag and get the world's awesome preheater? What's up, Peppa H, man? 
Yeah, Earl Moorhead goes, it's really rare for the ECU to fail. So my Nissan Murano, legit, like, I was a block away from my house. Let me let me just tell the people what happened. Yeah, guys, so I, was, I was legit, like, a block away from my house. Um, and I, I got it, it's okay. And uh, it just shut down. Like, luckily, I uh, I got out and, like, pushed it into, like, a parking spot. It was, it just shut off. It could have happened any time. But, you know, it's not the car's fault. I, I owned the car already for about, like, maybe four or five months, and it had no problem starting or anything like that. ECU just died. Um, really a safety concern, you know, because like, uh, and honestly, like the engine in the Murano was so smooth. I didn't even know it shut down because like the engine is so smooth. I only realized that the, that the car died when I had no power steering mm. and when the brakes were like the booster wasn't doing anything. That's right, how smooth right. that engine was. Sickening. It ain't no Pico. All right. Uh, <laughs> we've got the preheater. Um, so we're going to heat it up a little bit because, you know, we might have maybe even flooded it. Also, you when you rebuilt it, you added a lot of oil, right? Yeah. So the, the yeah. first time is always going to be a hard start. Yep. All right. So let's uh, let's get to it, gang. Okay, guys. Happy you're all here. Yeah, you got to. Yeah, let's uh, heat it. Just touch it directly on the top like that. Yeah, you could like touch it. It don't matter. It, it, it won't do nothing bad. Okay. Yeah. So, guys, I have the 2012 uh, Murano SL. Like with, with the nav, it's a nice car. You know, we're talking like 11 speaker, Bose system nav, um, satellite radio. What else it got? Yeah. Heated seats, it got, got, you know, no rips in the leather. All the bells and whistles. Yeah, although I, I will tell you, man, the leather seats are not very comfortable in that car. I remember selling those cars when they were due and the fabric seats were very comfy in Nissan. I think Nissan used, um, mem no, they used, uh, memory foam in the ultima seats for those model years all right let's see what happens so let thinking yeah let's see maybe it's enough maybe it's enough okay guys what's up woogie nitro how you doing bro so oh oops okay lucky we have grass on the floor you want to do a little more for you it's about to fire up but it's a little too much it's about to fire up guys come on Wish Brian luck over here. He ain't playing around. Somebody come here and bring us band-aids. All right, let's uh, let's chill. let's chill a little bit. Let's do a little more heating. Maybe removing of the glow plug. I'm gonna preheat this a little more, guys. Okay. Uh, I want to say special thanks to all of you guys for uh, being here. It's not every day that I go live anymore. You know. This is a big cooling head, so let's, um, oh man, I gotta put this in again, okay. Let's do a little more. What do you guys think is gonna happen? I mean, it, it was almost running. Yeah. It just, cause you know, we, you basically rebuilt it. The first time it's, it's really tough to fire it up after uh, yeah, it all the oil in it, so. Pain the butt. Yeah. Plus the wind is kind of like blowing some of this heat away from us. All right, let's um, undo the plug like a quarter of a turn, maybe. I have a plug driver if you need to. What do you guys think is going to happen? Yes, this is actually uh, the Chevron tires, uh, Woogie Nitro says, yeah, from the T-Max. These were some of the best tires back then. All right, I got the radio. It's better. It's gonna run. It's there, guys. Oh, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Discover the problem. Discover the, discover the problem. What's going on? Oh, I think we have. I'm rubber. pressing the throttle. Too much on the we rubber band. We have too much on the rubber band. You know what? It's not then the world. Let me check if your failsafe is set up. Hold on. I didn't set it up yet. You didn't set it up? No. Okay. Let's remove the glow plug there for a little bit. Um, I'm going to set the fail safe. Go ahead. All right. So we're going to do the fail safe. One of the pleasures of this radio, you don't need to bind nothing. You just basically go in the electronic menu, yep. go to channel two, uh, brake, press the throttle. I mean the brake. I usually do about 75%, 70. There we go. Now we can uh, go back. It should be set up. I'm going to turn it off. We'll check whether 
fail safe was applied. Done. Okay. Yeah, we got yep. brakes. All right. Awesome. Just in case. Let me check if it opens now. Okay, well, we need a little carb adjustment, but it's it's no big deal. Yeah, we got to work on the we EPA. Could, could, oh, man, this is like it. the world's strongest spring. Yes. <laughs> okay, let's see. We'll do it a little. That's okay. It's enough? Yeah, it's enough. It's enough. All right, let's try to get this. No way. Yeah, yeah, he'll put it on later. Oh, it's a runner. It's a runner. the brake it shut down okay so let me see let me see how far the carb closes when you press the brake no no the carb the gap is okay actually the gap is like one millimeter at most let me see your um, low speed setting on that card. Let me just take a look at it. Okay, low speed needle looks okay. It's about flush yeah, with I the car body. Yeah, pretty much at factory yeah. settings. Okay, so yeah, it, it looks okay. okay. I think we just need to like run this a little bit maybe. Warm it up a little bit, yep. Yeah. Maybe richen it actually. Let's try to richen it. I'm gonna put the tarp back on. You know what you're missing? The roll bar. I know. That's also another piece that's very hard yeah, to find on yeah, any it's hard of these to find. 25s. <laughs> okay, I'm going to put the filter back on for us. Okay. Yeah, the roll bar is tough to find. Um, high speed? Let's see, let's see. I'm, gonna, I'm going to just richen a little bit here Got it. in the high speed. All right. I sometimes do a little too much, but that's just to see if we have positive results. All right, let's try it again. Air filter issue, air filter issue. It's because we put this too close over it. Let's just actually- Put it in a high speed needle. Yeah. For now, we need a zip tie on that air filter. See how it's going. That's all. All right, let's, uh, let's just fire it up again for now. Pushed never, the glow plug never out. Never seen that before. It pushed the glow. I don't think we tightened it, dude. It pushed the glow oh, yeah. plug out. Well, it's really hot. Okay, it fell again. <laughs> we'll clean it. We'll clean it. Glow plug got got pushed out, guys. Spit it out. This happens on live. Sickening. Yeah. It's right here. Oh, yeah. It's hot. It's hot. Be careful, bro. Yeah. So, um, actually, I think it's gonna be fine. We didn't tighten the glow plug. I should have checked. 
uh, after we uh so basically ram with a glow plug almost out Perhaps. dude that's the os pico survivor i don't think anyone's ever seen that on the live stream before sickening Perhaps. all right we gotta we'll clean that one later yeah what about the washer the washer's still there i got washers okay we're good no, sickening. Dude, it's like super clean inside that Pico. Pico gang. Really wish these engines were made again. They were honestly very good bargain motors back yeah, then, right? Yeah, they were good. <laughs> Pearlbar goes glow plug ejecto mod. <laughs> yeah, you, can, you know, fortunately that's, you that's, can't that's, edit stuff on live, yeah. so you guys saw it's it. It's okay, this is real, this is real life, this is real life. <laughs> we make mistakes, but usually we make less mistakes than greatness. Right. Okay, sick of tight. Yeah, Close so plug. now actually my assumption on the on the idle is incorrect because we got to fire it up again because it was basically running lean before. Yeah, oh, we got off the chicks here from Germany. How you doing there, off the chicks? Off the you know, often chicks tuned in because, of course, we have an often Pico. She knew. That, that's why often chicks is here. She sees an, an often buggy or a Pico, it's over. She tunes in. She sits in the couch or like a nice sofa <laughs> with some popcorn, I think. Melissa, remind us to get popcorn later. What? <laughs> what, popcorn? Yeah, yeah Melissa and I love popcorn as a snack. It's got high, high protein, I mean fiber, you know? Yo, Brian, you eat snacks at night? Love it. What do you what do you like to eat, munch on at night? We do I'm, popcorn. I'm guilty of popcorn. Oh, that's a good one. And extra gummies. butter, extra butter, or? gummies. Any uh, sour sour sickening. gummies? Yeah, I like those. Sour I got the, the nitro princess. My daughter. Oh yes, yes, yes. Bella, she'll she be in a video. I, I love gummy there. candy too. And uh, yeah, yeah. We just, uh, we Daniel should. goes that glow plug must have tasted like bagel. <laughs> love it. Oh guys, I can't say that word anymore. Come on. Is no, that, lo no love. Can't talk about things okay. that are breakfast uh, shapes in uh, in a. Uh, you know, that's why today we got donuts. Where are the donuts, Melissa? Sorry. We got Remember, donuts. I went to Tim Hortons and I couldn't even order a, say it. English muffins is around, you guys. Oh, English you, muffins? You can put butter on it. You can put cream cheese on it. Melissa, are you, you can... hungry? Is that what you're talking about, English muffins? No, I'm just saying. We got to go shop at Costco later. Instead of there, English muffins are round too, you guys. Don't forget. So did the inflation hit the Costco $5 chicken yet? Anybody know? Not yet. I actually if got that I got the rotisserie for seven. Oh, what's used up? to be seven ninety nine. They're still seven ninety yeah. nine. We're good. We got a long time dedicated channel member what's viewer here. Indigo, how you doing? What's up, Indigo? Yeah, Indigo. yeah. Where we're, have you been? We're live right now. The RC track. We got Melissa. We got my friend Brian. You've seen him in the streams. Everyone boosted just RC. yeah boosted RC. That's because uh, he likes RC and he's he's a booster. You know. It's a booster, like, you know, with that movie, Fast and Furious? Something like that. Kidding around. <laughs> I got a supercharged Trans Am, so oh, that's where the, that's what, where year? the what year? 80. Oh, like I love those. I love those. So that's where the booster I love those. comes from. You got the louvers on it? In on the, the back? On the back, yeah. Oh, it's all yeah. about those louvers. Yeah. Let me ask you this. The Chrysler Starion, what do you think? Love it. That's a hot ride. Love the it. Chrysler Starion, bro. Very under... They need Very to bring under. the Chrysler New Yorker back as well. Great. Comfy seats, comfy Great. seats. What's up, Grateful Dabs? Okay. So, let's do another test this little uh, savage operation. We're uh, doing a savage operation, guys. Yeah. Let's let's do it. All right, you want to do this on the floor? Or? Uh, it's up to you. Move it up here. You right, I'll, 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 I'll do the radio. Radio's here. Okay. I'm not sure. I think I heard it hit second. Yeah, it hit second. Definitely. Did I say Mitsubishi or Plymouth Starion? Someone just said Mitsubishi Starion. Did I call it a Chrysler? You did. But what was the Chrysler version? Uh, the Chrysler Conquest. <laughs> Rinks got it. The yes. Conquest. Yes, yes, I got it in Yes, yes, My yes, bad. yes. All right. I'm hyped. Now that is a good idea. You're the repair team. Probably because uh, we didn't do any real like high acceleration. But bro, the two-speed cannot be killed. It's more reliable than the brand new Savages. 
You know, I took my Savage out of the box, had to go open the owner's manual. I'm gonna go back Sickening. one eighth of a turn on the high yeah, side. Yeah, yeah. Uh, I'm thinking our, hold on, our throttle trim is too high. Okay. Let's, can we put that like somewhere? Yeah, our throttle trim is too high. Um, let me lower the throttle trim a little bit. You dropped it again. So let me adjust yeah, it. I just it somewhere it. right around here. Yeah, I saw it right there. Oh, I, I got it. You got it? Yep. We got the Eagle, the Eagle Eye Melissa. Yeah. Once again, oh, she bailed found me the out washer. and she found the washer. Yeah, well, Melissa wears contacts for a reason. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? <laughs> I'm going to right. find anything. Okay, I lowered uh, the throttle trim a little bit, but we still need to adjust the carb here. All right, how you doing there, XTM? Unfortunately, today we don't have any XTMs, but we have a sea full of other nitros, everybody, okay? Plenty, plenty, plenty. Plenty of nitros. Um... All right, let's, let's do a little test do fire. This kind of like a test and tune. So a massive leak, everybody. We got leak gang. Let me flip this around. Watch this. Yeah, I see it. Yeah. Let me get Melissa's phone. In go goes, get some heat in her. Yeah, well, like... we just shifted to the two speed. I just, you see that? So I saw a couple drops right by yeah. where yeah, right the there. carb is over there. You guys see that? Right there, you guys. We have some kind of carb leak issue. This looks okay. Mm -hmm. More than likely, I'm wondering, the top looks okay here. I think somewhere on the bottom, there's a leak. We're gonna go to the engine, the let's seal. Go, let's take a little look. Can you flip it a little like this? Okay. Nitro uh, and electrics, how you doing, bro? Hmm. I saw a leak coming directly from that part. That's why I was leaning out, you heard it? Mm -hmm. It ran okay before. Yeah. Let's see, is the, is the carb loose? Seems no, the carb, the carb is tight. It seems tight, yeah. Is that the original O-ring? No, I had to replace it. I think I double upped on the yeah. O-ring as well. I think that's, well, it can't really be leaking from there because it will be like down in there. But the side of the crankcase over there looks looks wet. Yeah, I saw it directly. You saw it, right? Yeah. All right, let's, let's, let's put this on the back burner for now, I think. Um, something that needs to be investigated. It's, it's a little hot now, yeah. but. Then they go once to know if we got some gum. Unfortunately, um, gum went up in price. I didn't buy any. That and silly putty. Yeah, dude, I went to Walmart the other day. They want like uh, like $4 for a pack of Orbit. Sickening. It's, it's beyond sickening. I used to love Orbit. You should have told me I got it. I should have got gum yesterday. It's the Dollar Tree store. Melissa, you're going to buy $12 gum. Come on. Getting around. You're gonna buy Bubblicious. Like? Yeah, Bubblicious is good. Bad for your teeth though. All right. Let's uh. Sorry, it's no big deal. We'll uh. We'll hold this, we'll, one we'll hold this for another 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 day. Let's run something that we know is reliable. This baby right here. That's right. Earl Morehead goes Jado for the win. <laughs> yeah, you can't well, kill it. All right. Whatever you want. Next up, we got the newly rebuilt. Oh, we need some ride height on this. We need some shock. Yeah, reloads. a little bit. You have lower ride height in the back than Armas, bro. Yes. Nitro RS43 with the T3.0 engine. I still have one. With the two speed, baby. Them. Yeah, Melissa wants to know why yeah. you're not giving that thumbs up. Thumb it up, bro. Do it. Do it, it now. Only 79 people watching and there's 47 likes. 79 is about eight times more than my haters. Come on, guys, with all the likes are. This yeah. is great live. Oh, we got one. Yeah. Where'd you get this exhaust gasket? Uh, eBay? eBay. I usually buy them on THS. eBay. THS has five for like two bucks. I saw those too. These yeah. small block exhaust gaskets are real yep. nice. Where's Woogie Nitro? Woogie Nitro's here. Well, uh, hopefully, I don't know. What's up, Timothy Cunningham? How you doing, bro? 
All right, let me just. Oh, it didn't go. Sickening donation. Thank you for that, bro. Thank you, uh, thank you. The thumbers. Not sure what that means. Is that because like I, I bite my thumbs? I, I do. It's, it's bad. It's bad. The other day I was on like the subway. This person was staring me down. I, I didn't know whether he wanted to fight me because you know <laughs> it's New York City subway. Usually it's because they want to fight you. Uh, then this one woman walks across and she's like, "Nobody can touch this. You can't touch this." Oh jeez. She's like, "You you're not cool enough to touch this. You can't put your hands on me." But then she was like walking up to people's faces, including my own. And I'm over there <laughs> trying to mind my own business. I'm like, "Bro, I woke up at like 7:10 in the morning today." Uh, this buck was like $11 to get here. I just want to get to work. It's pissing me off. Yeah, I just want to get to work. Clock can do my civil duty. And she'd be trying to get me to touch this. <laughs> Sickening. True story, everybody. True story. All right. Melissa, say hello to Indigo and everybody. What's up, Indigo? Special thank you for that. Karen travels everywhere, goes around more. Yes, they sure do, bro. They yes, sure they do. do. All right. Uh, we got the roto start ready. Bro, don't give me the roto start, okay? I can make fun of that. No. Okay. The, the hair regrew, bro. The hair regrew. We're good. Save. You know whose hair didn't regrow? Haters. Oh, we got David VIP Auto. Bro, thank you for that donation. Happy to see you here. Um, I invited you over. So if you're still here, Brian and I, bro, we're, we're over here firing up nitros. Yeah. Bring whatever you want to test and tune. One of us will fire it up, but don't give me the roto start. No. So uh, thank you, you for that donation, bro. I got yeah, plenty. guys, Melissa, keep the roto start away from me. Shit's going to go I down. I am going to keep it away So actually, what, what happened with that roto start, that was a faulty button. When I pressed it, yeah. it, it just stuck. To, oh. it, it, it like stuck so i didn't really mean to to do that you know what i mean but listen i laughed at myself ain't nothing wrong with that but i had haters trying to make fun of it in a very condescending way there's nothing wrong with it yeah there's nothing wrong with that bro people no. pay for it all the time okay you regrew i eat my vitamins what's that hair vitamin that people eat? Um, no hair skin and nails no biotin 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 Make sure right. my battery doesn't die. Yeah, guys, we don't know how long this battery is going to last, but I think we got another maybe 15 to 20 minutes of the live. I did okay, hold on, hold on, hold on. Brian, hold on a second, bro. Let, right, me, let me just check all of your settings before yeah. uh, we do anything. Yeah. Okay. Don't don't fire it all. Oh, yeah, okay. Oh, good. Let me just check all of your... Okay. Yeah. You have no idea how many times I've, like, gotten RCs and people had, like, everything reverse servos. No, so if you fired it up and pressed throttle, it would be, it would be not good. Yeah, no, this one's... Let me check your... Fail safe? We nope. got no fail safe. No fail safe. On Yo, Brian, are you allergic to fail safe? I'm just kidding, A little bit. <laughs> okay. Let me set the thing. I, I actually love setting fail safes. That's why I waited. Yeah. I, I actually love like doing carb adjustments and trims. So I, I'm not even joking. I'm serious. All right. So let's go to fail safe. I'm disappointed. In you I know guys. a lot of people hate like to mess with carb adjustments. For me, it's like I love it. I will pay you to tr to trim your car. Okay. Okay. Channel two. We'll go to brakes. About seventy percent. That's it. Back. So now we'll check the failsafe. I'm going to turn off the radio. We got brakes. Now the reason, guys, I, I don't want it to be like full brake. We just, just don't want to run away. Just enough. Yeah. The reason yep. I don't do like a hundred percent on the failsafe brake. You know why? Uh, sometimes you like accidentally forget to turn. The radio off and and you act well to turn the car off and your servo will be constantly applying brakes Over, like accident powering it yeah and pretty much it. overnight yep. yep and uh you'll kill the servo usually or your battery first so yep always safe to be like 70 something percent yep. brakes all right uh rc hobbies wants to know what's the engine yes this is so the funny thing is what's up kgm man how you doing i thought uh, it was a g this is this has to be a t, t um, because i could see the engine mounts without engine blocks mm -hmm. So there's no side engine mounts. It mounts directly to the chassis. You see that right there? That means you don't have right here. That means you don't have any gear mesh adjustment, which which is fine. You so know. So the G was adjustable. So the G 3.0, which is like on the WRA, mm -hmm. it's on yep. the MT2. Yep, yep. It's it's also a pilot shaft. Yep. With a a slide carb. This Got was it. rotary. Right. So this one. HPI does sell like optional engine mounts mm -hmm. that you can adjust gear mesh. Yep, yep, yep. But unless you're changing, you know, gears or whatever, you don't mm -hmm. really need to do that, you know? Yeah. All right. Yep. Earl Moore goes hybrid ran into those trees. I actually did run into a tree one time with a Baja. <laughs> uh, unfortunately, I, you know, fortunately for me, I did manage to like activate the third channel kill switch, but like the Baja was going so fast, it still hit the tree. Yeah. So, <laughs> you know, it happens. Um, what I should have done that one time that I had a runaway, you know what I should have done? 
I should have turned the radio off. And just lock so it, it cuts spark also. Yep. That's 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 a tip for everybody, okay? Yeah. Um all right guys, let's let's check out what we got. I got the radio, okay? Okay, so your linkage looks okay. Yeah. Let's do the prime job. It's the prime job is a new movie with Nicholas Cage. It's called Gone in 60 Second Prime job. Okay, sit me. might be your best uh, running and idling engine, bro. This one and the FW06. Yeah. FW06 has a little bit of a two-speed issue. A little more bro. pain in the butt. But RS43. We'll... I keep telling HPI to bring them Amazing. back, and they don't listen to me, Amazing. bro. They, have they don't to. listen to me. They have to. Yeah. You guys saw it. And it goes there awesome when they hit 230. You guys saw it first, yep. firsthand. It started right up. Started right up. No hair was ripped out either. No. Sickening. Auto start super easy. Um, I, I love these engines. Love it. This was actually my very first Nitro, but the 15FE model. Mm -hmm. And the shaft drive is smooth. Look how, look how smooth, nice it rolls. Smooth. And the brakes, you will never need to do any brake amazing. mods. Amazing. amazing. Like, yeah. just amazing. Yeah. Two speed, very accurate, hits every time. Uh, and also to just easy. Right, this one just has the HSP fuel tank yeah. uh, with an adapted upper plate. Because like, you can't one, of the, one of the big cancers on these old cars as the fuel tanks because yeah. a lot of them had primers and they tend to yep. leak over time yep. you know i also noticed a lot of the older hpis mm -hmm. what happens is somebody usually does like a pipe upgrade and the pipe winds up hitting the side of the tank, it the tank. and it melts it yep. or just cracks it yep yep but this is good to see direct this is like a ten dollar uh, fuel tank on on ebay or like amazon you know all right bro so that one is good that one is good top anybody, uh top success what's next anybody what want to see the fw06 all right um we got a couple options now right Whatever. Uh, We're so open. we got some options. We uh, we Can should probably try to run something now. Can I sure. Choose? Melissa wants to choose. Go ahead. The Slayer. Slayer? Oh of no, course. she didn't. Melissa chose the best. You chose a Slayer. All right, Brian. Brian got it. We gotta do it. All his RCs fire up, except the ones we don't start. Okay. That's right. Just so you guys understand, there's no 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 false advertising here. They all start except when they don't. All right, guys. Uh, so Slayer, dude, I was actually gonna bring my Slayer today, but then then I decided I'm like, you know, you're probably gonna bring it. What am I gonna have two of them for you? Right, now? man, this is a great chassis. Anybody who does not have this, it's just a massive little car. Um, just, Inigo wants to know what is the air temperature now. Let me pull up my uh, right now? my temperature app. Probably about 80, 80, 80, 84. Let me show you guys right now. 80 degrees. So in in New York, the state of high taxes. And you know, jails where they just let you go home for nothing. Uh, 85, cloudy, you know. You could like commit almost any crime here in New York now and be okay, you know? <laughs> Except tax evasion, they'll, they'll rape you. Yeah, they'll get you. 
Yeah, you don't pay your taxes, they'll rape you, unless, of course, you're like, you know, Trump or something. Oh, you don't pay medical bills. <laughs> oh, yeah. Dude, Melissa went to, like, CVS Mini Clinic, like, a few months ago. They told her, like, the insurance will cover it. And turns out they didn't cover nothing. We got, like, a $200 bill for, like, a nose trip right now. Sickening. They, they put it into collections. Yeah. We just paid it, like, two days ago. Sickening. So I was avoiding paying yeah. it. <laughs> All right, guys, just uh, to catch everyone else up, I'm over here at the RC track. It's Saturday. Tomorrow we're supposed to have like a bad storm, so I figure today will be a good day. Uh, it shouldn't be that windy right now. Uh, Pearls was just coming in. We got Boosted RC, a real name Brian, last name Boosted, okay? That's very straightforward. Middle name Sickening. Okay, we got Nitro Queen Melissa over here. Um, yeah, well, I me, mean, you know who I am. You know, I'm a guy that wears pink shirts. Uh, if you're wondering how many it's of these right pink here. shirts I have, it's literally one of them. I thought okay. it was fuchsia. Yeah, fuchsia. I don't even know how to spell that. <laughs> Kidding around. <laughs> it's right. Maybe it's burgundy, like Ron. Ron. It looks like it's the sun dying. Like nah, it's okay because we're in the sun. So I don't know how much longer we're going to be able to do this. We'll fire up the Slayer, do a little lap, because uh, I think this one's actually like drivable, right, Brian? Should be, yeah. Okay, people say my shirt's red. It is red. Am I colorblind? I know I passed that test like in high school. Are you sure this is pink? It's red. I don't care. I have a pink laptop. Okay, I have a pink laptop. It's rose. It's rose. <laughs> it's rose. rose. Gold. It's rose. My it's rose gold. Okay. Your laptop. All right. Let's uh, I have let's a gray laptop. let's hit the Slayer. <laughs> okay, rings goes. It's a blouse. Yes, I love my blouse. Blousing. Okay, hold on, bro. Fuel? How are we on the fail safe over here? Uh, I think we're gonna have a situation again. You know how I do. Yeah. <laughs> I wait for yeah. you. <laughs> All right. Let's check it out. We do this to show let's everybody. Yeah. Extra fail safe. This was planned. Brian purposely turned them off. You guys got to know how oh. to set them. He got a fail safe on this one. Sickening. He got one. Okay. I'll do like half a tank or something. Yeah. All right. All right. Yeah. All right. Okay. I got the radio. We can do a couple laps probably. Okay. Yeah. Bob's got to see goes what fail safe. <laughs> Yep, I see the clear fuel in there. That was a good question. I want to answer it. Go ahead. Because um, I don't know if they can hear me over the, over the phone. So Inigo wants to know if you if you had the option of buying brand new today, uh, Slash or T Max. I think I think he's referring to the two-wheel drive slash and the 3.3 T Max, uh, unless I'm mistaken. Of course. What would you do, Brian? Bro, well, do you, do they you have, have the they slash? They do have. I have a. Sl I have the slash, but it's. I bought it with a castle, and it was a conversion. Oh, I see. Okay. That was the one that you and me ran. That. Yeah, was I remember that one. That was too fast. And it's just ridiculous. What about a nitro slash versus a T Max? A main does have that sale. I know yeah. everybody's like the 2.5 is on sale. Well, only the red one. Right, right. So I, I would, I would go honestly, with slash. I would, I would probably go with slash. Yeah. Slash. Um, the 2.5 T Max has like that sickening cl clunk transmission. The 3.3 yeah. is the one was the one you want. Yeah. You get but that, you get that judder. I would say if you just want like spend a little less oh, and you want to go hella fast and you want to make Melissa happy, get the slash. Yeah. Let's get the slash because I like the you slash. Know, yeah, Melissa was sleep talking in her dream tonight, and uh, she said, "Slash, baby, slash." It's I'm a, kidding it's around. A, it's a win-win situation, you know. <laughs> I'm kidding make, around. Make her happy. Yeah, make her happy. Buy, buy a now. slash. Hit the button. Okay. Basically. Okay, All right, Sean, how you doing, bro? Happy to see you here. We got a good comment here from Sean. He goes, he refuses to buy anything uh, Traxxas. You know, you'd be surprised how many times I, I hear people say that, but it's kind of irrational because, like, you know, we're we're not the dictators of like what they sell. They sell what they sell, regardless of our individual decisions. Um, it's like the way you vote, it, it doesn't matter. The, the district lines are drawn in a way that your state will always be whatever your state is. Make Nitro great again, get any Nitro, okay? That's what I say. The way I look at it, I was an HPI guy all, all the way back from the early 2000s. So eventually I started do, doing Traxxas. What you gotta remember is, when you're gonna go ahead and order something, remember what's the parts availability. Yeah. And the Traxxas has the best parts availability. And, There's and, the best. And, and I come from the automotive industry. 
they interchange. So yeah. not only can you get parts for a Slayer, you can get parts for the Revo that match as well. So remember that. Cause yeah, there's really no reason to hate on Traxxas because like parts no. are there. Uh, I agree they haven't updated the 3.3 in like over a decade, but who cares? That's it. That's it. I Audi get... Audi hasn't fixed the Audi Q5 uh, everything breaks problem no. in forever. Yeah, I had to get parts from Italy to... Q5 to, breaks to, all the time. To, to that's why I don't have one. To fix my Pico. Sickening. So. Okay. All right. That's, that's I think I think we've answered some people's questions. Maybe all right. Let's so let's go back, guys. All right. All right. Let's shut up. We're gonna run a little something, okay? Brian, you're gonna take this on a couple laps, maybe for us. Yeah. So people see some sickening action. <laughs> Too rich. So basically what happens is I accelerate kind of slow, but it's all right. the commentating sickening the two speed works each and every time two speed baby i heard it and this thing is fast this will approach 50. oh it landed it landed it's like a goat two speed baby dude the two speed shift point is awesome Oh, sickening. It's okay, we'll flip it over, we'll flip it over. Those uh, Slayer wheels, they're like short course tires, you know, so they grip really well. Sickening. Awesome suspension, awesome two speed. Incredible brakes as well. Sickening. A lot of traction from those tires, especially like when you're in the turn. Well, the thing is meant to be kind of run on dirt, you know? All right, guys, special thanks to all of you guys here. Uh, please carry on your conversations. Slayer, don't turn off even when it's flipped over, you know? That's right, Center of Fire, how you doing? What's up, Tegrity? Running the Slayer. All right, it's running okay. Awesome brakes, I would say the best. Pussy baby. Oh, that flip almost tried to kill it. All right, let's let it chill for a little. What is great. And guys, today's kind of a hot day. All right, it's time for me to run something, I think. Bro, it's running good. Yeah. Running great. All right, my dudes. What? Sickening. All right, Brian's going to shut it down for a little bit. I, um... I need to run something too, I think, guys. All right, what do you what do you think? Should I uh, run something or what? I don't know how much uh, time we have on the live, but what if the live ends or the phone shuts off? You know, Brian and I are gonna keep uh, running rich and loud and a little dirty. Okay. I think we should do the John Deere. I think it's John Deere day. Okay, Brian yeah. said it. The grass is high over here. Let's do it. The Get grass is high, and our spirits are higher. All right. Liz, can you get my uh, Fly Sky Radio? All right, guys, who remembers this right there? The John Deere Revo, bro. Okay, you can mow the lawn, you can 
irrigate some land. You can go to the tractor supply store, whatever the hell you want. All right. Let me uh, set up over here, guys. Sickening classic. Yes, I. Uh, there's a couple of videos of this on the channel already. So, I bought this one a while ago. Hey, Melissa, uh, I should have some body clips. Can you get me some of the body clips I have in my uh, in the bag, I think? Sickening, everybody, okay? Timothy Cunningham, okay. 3.3, uh, this is the older body, the older style. Um, cause you could tell because it has the older talent style wheels for now. Uh, I will tell you. Oh, who's to Baja? Got some clips, okay. Yeah, I just need. All right, Melissa, it's okay. You don't even have any in there. I didn't take any. I must have forgot to uh, take, take them. Take them all. No, I just need. Oh, that, well, is, that, is that how that, they are? That's, that's a Polish one. Oh, shit. You guys ever seen body clips like this? <laughs> <laughs> what, what is that? Interlocking? It's Polish. What is this? The, the COVID of the body clips? Yeah, put it in Sitting. backwards. Let's, let's, let's try it. Hold on. Does the COVID body clip edition. Hold on. How you put this in? Dude, dude, who, who did that? That's great. <laughs> it's bad fun. All right. It's okay. It'll, it'll be good for now. It'll be good. It'll be, right. it'll be all right. Sickening. Never seen that in my life right here. Um, all right, so we need the glow driver, Melissa. We need fuel. Let's see. Okay. Melissa, get, oh yeah, you got fuel, okay. All right, guys, I'm going to uh, move the camera here slightly. I'll give you the first hand view of uh, what is going on with the John Deere Revo edition, okay? Got this one a while ago. It's, it, it honestly, I'm gonna tell you something here. I don't know who here agrees with me. I was just talking to this, uh, to Benjamin Martinez. It's like all the 3.3s I have, they seem to have like a personality of their own. Some run like really rich, some run really hot. Uh, some don't hold the tune well. It's, it's like they all have a personality, you know? It's like fucking sick and okay. All right, uh, Sean, you have a good time. Sean is about to run a Losi bagel. You have a good time, bro. Losi bagels, sickening. Or English muffins. I'm not allowed to talk about Losi bagels anymore. Or English so. muffins. Yeah, Get English around. muffins. I only talk about bagels. I mean donuts. <laughs> Melissa, where's our donuts? In the car. Can you get the donuts? Why? The people want to see. Uh, Thanks, the, Brian. the people. The people want to see a true Losi donut. Let's go. Oh, Brian's getting the donuts. Okay. Blame USA. How you doing? Yes, I'm gonna blame the donuts. I mean the bagels. No. My bad. English Brian's English. gonna get us some uh, proper Losi, mo mo you know, <laughs> paraphernalia right here. There we go. He's doing the. Let's open it up. This is the new Losi Promoto donut. You guys are having a good time. I'm gonna have possibly this one. You can have a donut, bro. All right. See that Losi uh, donut, bro. Okay. Let me let me let me chew it a little bit. Delicious, and not like five ninety nine. No lipo needed. Well, let me eat a little donut. I just want to take a bite. What's up, Michael Suchup? We do have a temp gauge. Why, well, you want us to do a temp test on it or something? It's okay. Well, you don't want to go full Losey donut. Like they say in that video. Check the donut. Oh. <laughs> I'll try the donut. Check the donut. Whew, the a donut hot. Is, a, is a it's a hot it's a hot, hot commodity, bro. It over, it's about to overheat. <laughs> Sickening. Right. The bones brew. Oh dude. Yeah. Oh. This is I uh I actually saved like the very last of my bones brew for Cerebo. I never Texas bought yeah. it all. Yeah, yeah. yeah Texas Texas, Texas Hill bought all the bones brew for us, so it's okay, he deserves it, man. He uses uh, some great decoration. That's it. Uh like Woogie Nitro, right? Or does he do decorate with no Varasi boxes? I think it's no Varasi boxes. Right, so this is the real the real deal. 30% uh, nitro, 10% oil. Guys, so enjoy it while we got it because it ain't none left. Okay? And especially because this, this fuel is not clear. You know, sickening clear fuel. Who would have thought of that? Yeah. I don't think a single RC brand of fuel has ever made clear fuel other than BP. Yeah. You need that to have some color, you know? Sickening. Send your send your fuel to get a tan. All right. Oh yeah, Sean, we love yanking. You see that? He just sank the fuel tank. Sickening. <laughs> All right, that's enough. 
we gotta preserve it. This fuel bottle leaks a little bit because like this this cap is not the bones brew cap. This is like from a Venom fuel tank mm -hmm. fuel bottle, and it doesn't it doesn't screw into well. Traxxas ones aren't great either. Yeah, the Traxxas ones if you could even remove like that that mm -hmm. rubber cap, you know what I mean? All right, guys, let's see what happens. It should be okay. I haven't started this in a long time. Um, okay. How you doing there, white boy? He goes, he got 16 quarts of the bones brew, bro. You are lucky. Oof. You are lucky. Okay. Let's see, I got this. The only problem, the only problem we could have is a slipping one-way bearing. High possibility that will happen. I got a wrench. Super in insane. Let me, I'm going to put this on for now, okay? Oh, man. This fuel. No, no, no. Oh, sick. Yeah, you might have to use that. <laughs> uh, I think it should fire up. We'll but the one-way bearing for sure does slip a lot. So, unfortunately, that's what it is. Yeah, we don't need, like, all the fuel. Okay. All right, guys. What do you think is going to happen, everybody? Alan Patterson, uh, thank you for still being here, everybody. All right, so we're going to... I'm going to do it from here. Oh, you got it? Okay. Is this one mine? Yeah. It's bad. Ooh, the one way. It'll, it'll fire up. Watch, watch, watch. It'll fire up. Oops. It'll fire up. Watch this. Go ahead. All right, Melissa, make sure like we're in proper video. I can see you. It'll eventually fire. It does that. Watch, this is going to fire up. A little bit of love. It's gonna get there. Let me move it this way. Uh, can the viewers see what I'm doing? Five minutes later. <laughs> this old, guys, this old. <laughs> you know how many nitros I gotta repair? I can't have all of them running. Not as old as me, though. Oh, oh yeah. I have nine plus one. Ten minutes later. Okay, hold on. We're gonna prime it more. Press the, press the fuel all the way, the, the throttle. Okay, that's it. Okay, well, yeah, we don't need any. I think it'll start. Well, there we go. Guys, I'm gonna hold the phone and, and record, okay? What do you think about that? I told you it's hella reliable. I'm just gonna drive it slow. It's not the fastest one, but it's reliable. Sickening. Revo John Deere, baby. Can't kill it. If you can start it. Toothy, baby! Reliable. You guys thought the one-way bearing was going to get us down? I don't think so, bro. It will never get us down. You hear that idol? That's an idol. Yeah, Brian, run something, bro. All right, Brian's gonna fire up his Jado. How's the quality, okay, everybody? I'm trying my best over here. 
juicy, baby. Yeah, when this thing is on the two speed, it's, it's nice. Factory steering, no servo upgrades. Sickening brakes. No flips, Revo suspension. I think Brian fired up the Jado. That's right, Grateful Dabs. Yo, and this thing is like super rich. It's super rich. Richer than our senators that rob this country. Oh, oh, we got another nitro on the track. Too rich to die, to die, guys. Don't worry about it. Traxxas is not bad. Just because you see a nitro die, don't mean Traxxas fault, you know? Sick of it. Everyone's going to want to blame Traxxas after this. They're like, hybrid, man. The nitro died. Who died? I'm doing one-handed driving, everybody. One-handed, I'm sorry, okay? Toosty, baby. Man, that Revo, no flips. The world's most stable suspension. One-handed driving. 3.3 is all you need. Two speed, baby. What do you think about that? That's why I didn't go go sick. Oh, I think I ran out of fuel. I only started with like half a tank. My bad. All right, guys. Let me uh, let me check it out. Sickening. Those one-handed driving. I didn't even flip. Let me check. Oh, I was incorrect. I still got fuel. I still got fuel, okay? Let's uh, go over to home base. We still got the Jato on the track. All right. Gonna go to home base. We still got the Jato. That's a great one in 3.3. Oh, oh, okay. He brought us the electric start. Oh, man, we need the... the Oh, okay. Sickening. Let's see if we can fire this up. Sickening. Black support. Black support, guys. All right. I'm going to put it back over here on the bleachers for a little. Oh, shut down. Let me uh, go to the, to the car. Sickening. I'm gonna leave it like this for a second here. Let's do a couple of small laps. All right, guys, I'm back. I'm gonna narrate and we're gonna drive. Almost had a collision. Yeah, my Revo is like really rich. That's what it is. It's like richer than, than our senators. Oh, shut down. I gotta raise my idle a little bit. Uh, Sean Moore, how you doing? 
Shut down, shut down. I'm gonna wait for tech support, tech support. Services should come soon. Let me uh, move this over. I'm gonna go uh, tech support myself, okay? I'm gonna call Triple A. guys can't kill the two speed I'm gonna back up the camera a little And that's an old Revo right there. That's not even a new one. Oh, oh, it shut down. That's because I got something on my foot. These spiky things, what the hell is that? I got some spike shit on my foot. Damn it. Ah, ah, thorns. Oh, shit. Ah, ah. Oh man, oh man. Ah. Oh, they try to kill me. Some on my shoe right here. Oh, that's what I go through, guys, to burn some nitro. I need new shoes, man. These are the world's worst shoes. What the hell? I should be embarrassed right now, but I'm not, cause I got a Rebo. Okay, sickening. I should be embarrassed, but I'm not. All right, let's uh, let's discuss what went down. I need a haircut. I need new shoes, but I always need more nitros. Um, I doing there, Melissa? Doing all right? What's wrong? You look a little sad. You want a little cheer up, guys? <laughs> Melissa looks sad. Tell her to cheer the hell up. She trying to piss me off with the sad face. I can't do the sad face. You know it upsets me. My hand just from hurts. Yeah, guys, Melissa fell. We were riding a scooter that day. You know what I'm saying? Okay, let me go back to home base. Um, so the thing is, Melissa, can you take uh, Brian's uh, RC yeah. stuff over here? The thing is, that particular Revo, it's it's really really rich, but that's okay. That's how I like it. You know, it's uh, that's an old generation Revo. It's like from the rich and loud era. You understand? I I I, I got it, I got it, I got it. Okay, let's go back to home base. Home base. All right, we're gonna roll the Revo back. We'll go see what else is in stock for us. Uh, I want to say special thanks to everyone that's here, people that uh, donated during this channel. I'm gonna use it to buy like you no know, deodorant. I went to CVS the other day. Deodorant was like 950. Brian, did you go to buy CVS deodorant the other day? It's like they went up for like 950. Everything's going up. 950 for deodorant. They Everything. used to be like 299. Everything. I'd rather walk around stinking. I'd rather buy eight nitros. <laughs> but you know, what are you gonna do? That's All it. right, bro. So um, I see you pulled out another nitro for us. We're gonna try the FWO. Let's show it to them. Here we go. We got the FWO6 guys. Did the old school body. The rotary RX7. RX7. Yeah, <laughs> Inigo goes do as the French do. We Eat baguettes and not wear deodorant, right? We, Those we. baguettes. <laughs> That's right. Those Vallejo baguettes, so to say. 
Melissa, we need to turn off the RC. Please, thanks, okay? Okay. Sean, you are always welcome on this channel, bro. You know, you know, you know, Sean, what's, what's good about me? I support my haters. I support you, bro. If you want to come out here, we'll do a little push-up contest, you and I. Um, if I win, I'll still like you. If you win, you yeah. gotta buy me pizza. You like those odds? And a nitro. Okay. Yeah, and a nitro. You know? And Melissa, she wants like a burrito, you know, from Chipotle. Yeah. Okay, but anyways, bro, I'm happy you're here. If you wanna trash talk about whatever, that's fine, man, that's fine. This channel has a lot of positive people. Half of us take lithium supplements. We're all so positive. And uh, you ain't gonna catch us in a bad mood. Am no. I right about that, Brian, bro? No, I take Dude, magnesium. Brian's the most positive guy ever. He takes Magnes magnesium. Magnesium every day? That's right. Magnesium every day, bro. And I'm married. And, exactly. So he's super happy. And, and his daughter loves nitro. That's it. Nitro Sickening. princess. We Incredible. Got nitro Incredible. queen. Yeah. We're happy people over here. And we both drive Toyotas. That's it. Well, not me today, but you understand. That means we, we you know, we don't spend a lot of money on nonsense repairs for BMWs. That's it. All right, bro. Sickening. Yeah, so um, this one is still available on A-Main. It's like 260 for the kit. It comes with the engine. The only thing you need is the servo and uh, radio gear. Everybody needs to buy this one. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, Melissa, can you hold on a second? Hold on a second. Melissa, can you take the body off? We'll uh, turn this off. This doesn't have a very good battery, so I gotta like really, really turn it off. The battery's kind of shit on it. But yeah, dude, look how clean it is. This is like a very, very old Revo. This is, in fact, I think ones I got. Can you tell that it even has the non-painted jack? Mm -hmm. That's one of the first generations. Yep, yep. So this one has the forward-only conversion installed, by the way. So no reverse. The reverse has been eliminated. Yep. You know, two-speed is solid. Never stripped the... Oh, shit. Do we have a metal spur here? I think we got... No, no, that's plastic. Yeah. It's on both left. I need more routine. They are okay. Sickening. And the electric start system. It always runs. You saw that we had nothing but slipping yep. bearings. So the Terra Crusher that I just got that I'm rebuilding from my 80 year old neighbor who gifted it to me, uh, we might have to convert. <clears throat> and granted, he drive he drove it like once or twice. We might have to convert it over to a electric Traxxas, start. Yeah, yeah, electric start. I'm thinking the Pro 15 would be a direct fit system. Yeah, I think the Pro 15 because the Pro 15 electric start. Uh, it's a larger back plate than the yep. 2.5. Yep. Do you have one of those? The Pro 15 model? Yeah, for electric starts? Okay. All right, so yeah. you can, you can so test it gonna, out. Okay. We're going to have to try to convert it yeah. over because even if it's brand new, we're, we're talking about a, you know, we're talking about a starter yeah. that's 25 years I'm old. I'm curious to see whether your Terra Crusher will have the slipping forward uh, clutch like mine. Well, I have two Terra Crushers. noise going nowhere. Then I said, oh, that's just you with the fart can exhaust. I'm kidding around. So... <laughs> I went through the engine, gummed it up, cleaned the crank, polished everything, and so we'll, we'll see what happens. Yeah, those were pretty good, like 0.18 to me yeah. engines, single needle carbs yeah. at that time period. Yeah. I ran it. I remember it was, it was fun mm -hmm. when they were new. Yeah. Um, so I'm curious to see how yours is going to be, bro. Okay. We'll see. Well, I, I am the resident Terra Crusher expert, so that's any it. questions? Okay. Okay. All right, bro. I'm going to shut up. Let's uh, fire this up. Let's, let, let's check the fail safe. Oh. You know how this works. Oh, you know I leave everything. <laughs> yeah. All the fail for you. Yeah. Sickening. Okay, hold on. Okay, he got it on this one. Proud of you, bro. Okay. All right. All right. So this is a pretty simple chassis. Yeah. It comes with wheels. It comes with this in engine. Mm -hmm. It's a pull start. It has very good compression. Yep. And um, I think... And they're 12 millimeter hubs. Yeah, standard, so standard. Uh, we got pivot ball suspension here in the yep. front. Aluminum shocks. They don't leak. Mm -hmm. uh, ride height is a little low. I will tell you on these... Yeah, you even yeah, I didn't you did everything the, possible to raise it. I didn't look at the wise when he had it here no, last okay. time. No, it's okay. It's okay. I see in the front you're in the top setting for the yeah, shop. That's move that's it normal. In. Well, it's already it's, it's already at the top setting there, so oh, you, the you, you're you're yeah. you're pretty much done. So uh, on the rear, on the rear you can raise it actually right yeah. there on the top. Mm -hmm. I have mine raised. I wish they did like more of an inboard, yeah. inboard shock there. But yeah, what are you yeah. gonna do? Ride height. I mean, it's a, it's a tenth scale. That's how mm -hmm. they are. You know. Normally, these are meant to be run on like smooth pavement. Right, right. But we could just drive it normally. Yeah, we'll keep it we on the go, inside. We'll go circle. on the side for you. We're going to run it in the parking lot out there. Well, that, that, that pavement is super coarse. <laughs> yeah. Right, bro. Uh, you need me to do anything? I got the radio. Yeah, it should fire right up. I don't know, Melissa. We'll know how much battery you have when the stream dies. Oh, you know? It didn't say it. It didn't say it yet. So you still have battery, I think.
Yeah, it's our TV. I know the two-speed shifted before. So we're just gonna drive it a little more over here. Sounds like something is rubbing. Uh-oh, hold on. Something is not sounding good. Uh-oh. Something happened. How, how did you just strip that gear right gear now? Before. You had a problem with gear mesh? Yep, did you ever I, replace the spur gear? That no, one? I did the, the butter knife trick, cleaned them we up. We could a still clean bit. that up. It's not that bad. I've cleaned which, it up better than that. Which is weird because I never hit anything, but yeah. it, sh it shifted by itself. So I put that, blocked, that is the weird. Not good. It. Yeah, engine. Let's, let's check out the screws. Let's check out the screws. Hold on, bro. How's that? I even did the newspaper trick in between the gears. So. The thing is, these screws don't even really have mesh Stop adjustment play, right? that way. So how is that? Yeah, but your gear isn't totally dead. You could still clean it, but I don't think right now you'll be able to. Yeah. You have to disassemble it. It's still fixable, though. I, I've repaired worse mm -hmm. gears than this. Sickening. They do have metal gear upgrades for it. So. Okay. Okay, we've got people talking about the moon being the night sky. That, that's not a fact. I mean, night sun. That's just not a fact. Your your, uh, your your boyfriend needs to uh, open up an astronomy book. Okay. Um, okay. So weird, man. Yeah. House. Okay. Hold on. Am I? It seems maybe a little bit. No, but I can't even move with my fingers. If you move a slow watch, it catches. Yeah, it still catches. I think if you just adjust no. it a little bit. Yeah. There was there was a, a high point where it would catch a oh, little yeah. bit. Yeah. Not like the RS4, thinking, the RS4 was butter. I'm thinking when you remove these screws, yeah, um, enlarge these holes a little bit down, you know, that way, down. to move the engine that way. Closer. Because it looks like you're- there's not mesh, much adjustment. But there isn't any. Right. The, the, there's no like movement this way for mm -hmm. the engine. Yeah, yeah. Um, just get a drill a little bit and, mm -hmm. and just- Dremel it. Do like- half a millimeter that's all you need yep, yep that's all you need and you'll be fine man once the gear mesh is better mm -hmm. all right that's basically what we got sickening up w6 situation over here but the engine's good yeah sure. brakes are good yeah these kyosho chassis they're like a little bit flexible too i noticed it was a great kit to build though yeah it was fun it was and really, it comes with it the really engine. was you you can't beat it on yeah. a main that's why i jumped all over it yeah all right, guys, we're going to do maybe like one more and then we're going to uh, call it a day. So uh, because basically the phone's going to die in a little while, you know, so I uh, want to say a special thanks to all you being here. Melissa probably got to call her mom again. Bro, what's your mom want to ask? Whether you want string beans? No. Tell her I want string beans. She wants to know you have the hot day tonight for the blooming onion. Sick it. Oh, shit. You're right. The blue... uh, I thought you forgot. No, I didn't. We were supposed to. We were supposed to go to Outback Steakhouse tonight, guys. I know. It's gonna happen. Sick it. We got a coupon for a blooming onion. You know what I mean? I'm not kidding around. You think I would go to there and pay uh, twelve dollars for a blooming onion? Hell no. Yeah, buy nitro. Coupon. coupon, bro. Coupon. Okay. Let's um. Let's see what we got. One. We have anything else we want to test, bro? I it's, do. It's up to you. You got anything else? Well, I always got nitros, but like you know, for me, it's. it's... See, I know. Well, I got I, the Jado, but. I haven't but... seen your Jado yet. You haven't seen the Jado? I have. The one that I, uh... Yeah, it was very popular. Yeah, it was very popular. That's the big wheel Jado. Well, let's start. Uh, what, Melissa? The slack? Well, no, 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 I don't want to do that one. All right, guys. So Brian requested a special... It's electric. They're going to laugh at me. Guys, I brought an electric slash, okay? You can laugh at me if you want. It's fine. It should sell super fast. You can say it's Melissa's. It's mine. Well, technically, I did buy it for her. Oh, then it's mine. Yeah. Then nobody can say anything. Yeah, that's true. All right, Melissa, you want to get that Jado, please? You can't hate me, guys. It's so All right, so this is uh, the Max. one from this is the one from the last live where I replaced a servo that you gave me. Yep, yep. So the whole goal of this video is supposed to be to test out these Arma tires. They might be a little too big. The thing is, I killed the original tires. It should be good though. Yeah, two speeds reliable on this. It'll fire up. Yeah, we can go. All right, let's go, guys. Dude, we got lucky we avoided the rain today, right, so far? Yeah. And we ran everything we wanted to, basically. There's no rain today. So far, only one catastrophe. It's uh, something that was kind of brewing already. All right, guys, so this is my Jado right here. Is this your radio? That's your radio. Yeah. Okay, my radio's in worse shape. 
All right. All right, Melissa. Um, we're gonna get Melissa to record me now. Uh, it might be a little windy, guys, so if it is, you know, I'm sorry about that. Nothing I can do about the wind, you know, global warming did it. Turn off your air conditioners and suffer. <laughs> then we'll change the wind patterns, all right? Uh, do I have fuel? What's up, you guys? I have a little bit of fuel, but we'll add a little more. Right. Radio. This Jado should be fine. So we are model 10. Xavier says, no, blast the AC, laugh out loud. Yeah. I want to be eco for. Oh man, my power switch has fallen. Look at this. How many the viewers screw. we got? Um, uh, 66. How many likes? 69. Uh, something okay. wrong with this power switch, bro needs to be cleaned. Why is my power switch all out? Okay, this needs to be, we, do we have any compressed air or anything like that? Let me clean, get, get, zoom in, zoom in, zoom in. Okay, let's see, I gotta, I have dirt in my power switch, the clay. It's okay, it's okay, we can, we can do it. Ah, sickening. Let me see if I can wipe this. Do they see what I'm doing? Yes. Um, Melissa, talk to Nitro again. Texas, um, not Texas, yeah. Um, oh, yeah, Patterson sickening. Toothbrush. Oh, sick. I mean, I I make green yeah. green beans. <laughs> oh, man, I love green beans. Imagine Texas Hill making up some steak and green beans. No, it was Alan Patterson. Uh, oh, oh, that was Alan Patterson? Yeah. Dude, this power, I see what happened. Xavier this part says, inside. Xavier. Oh, so, so, thanks, Xavier. <laughs> the part that holds the screw. Oh. Uh, has, Texas show Hill. show them this. Do they see this part uh -huh, in there? Uh -huh. It's blocking my power switch from turning on. See that, guys? Sick. We need, do we have like any really thin pliers I can remove it? I got everything you need. Okay, you guys see what's going on right there? The, the screw retainer. Sure. Okay, this, that should be good, that should be good. I make awesome I need to take this out. chicken cutlets and awesome brown. Oh, please, please oh, come out. Okay, yeah, we got it, we got it. Right here. This part will stop, so I need a power switch, it looks like. Okay, okay. <laughs> Damn, there's more. There's more. Holy moly. Collard greens and bacon. That whole thing broke off probably in uh in an accident or something. Bacon's like for breakfast. I don't really like bacon, guys. Uh, Bacon's overrated. I like bacon. I only cook bacon on my Baja. Oh, that was the video nobody watched. You know what we do here? Okay. Okay, we got it, baby. We pay things forward. So oh, this is gonna go to him. Sickening. No, you know what? I, I, I should have a power switch. I don't, I don't I got about no, 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 10,000 no, no, of these, too. I, have, I have a power switch. <laughs> I should have a power switch at home. I use the same ones, the Apex RC ones. I'm good. If anybody needs to oppie drive, yeah. I got like 10,000 of them. What I'll do, I'll probably just... Yeah, you see right here, it, it, the screw took a chunk out of it. Yep. No, we got it's okay. Bags. We'll still get one over here. So, um, I think for this one, it'll be okay. Yeah, it'll be good. It, it, it's, fine. it's on. It's Perfect. on. Xavier just can't wait for All right, guys. Wish me luck. No one knows what's gonna happen. Ah, uh, it's a Jado. Must fire. Yeah. <laughs> Too much fuel. Okay. This is the Jado from all of my uh, speed run videos. Yep. This is the same one. The one with all the GoPro action. This is like my very first Jado I got. Then I got three more. Yep. Then I sold like two to Dan Y. You never have you too know? much. To yeah. Um, all right, let's put the body on. It's reliable. I don't even have to keep the body off. But let's hope the power switch don't turn off. That's going to be bad. Melissa, put what they some saying? It says put some bacon on the bacon, please. Yeah, right? <laughs> I don't know what this obsession with the bacon is. I don't like it. I like bacon. Well, why don't you explain to me the obsession? I like Chinese food, okay? I know you You know like, what they don't I eat in Chinese, like Chinese food? food? They don't eat bacon. Chicken and broccoli. Chicken <laughs> and broccoli. Healthy, bro. Fiber and protein. Yep. All right. Uh, Jado gang. Can Everybody see. could see okay? Yeah. Can you guys see the Jado? You guys? Let me know. Right now. Gotta prime it and then do the primer. Okay, it's uh, clogged a little.
problem. Drives real bad with these big tires. Real bad. <laughs> real bad with the armor tires. Toasty <laughs> baby. on the grass. Thank <laughs> you. 
He's out of fuel. Out of fuel, guys, out of fuel. Alright. It's on 20%. Show them to me. Alright, guys, we're gonna be here for like five more minutes. I appreciate you all being here. The phone's gonna shut down, it's getting windy. Special thanks to everyone that uh, donated, supported this channel. Uh, keep Nitro alive. Keep me away from the low sea bagel. Don't make me get a bagel. Make me eat a donut. Shut down. He put more oil in his fuel. Fuel in his Jada. All right. Keep nitro alive. Yep. Gotta prime it again now. Oh, it's hot. Sickening. <laughs> My idol's too low. Well, guys, what do you think? Giant armor wheels or what? Yes, no, maybe. Oh, I see someone just came here in a Mustang GT. I think that's my buddy. How you doing there, bro? What's going on? All right, let's go. Let's go uh, check out what happened. Oh, that sounds sad right there. All right, uh, let, me, let me see my, my, the dudes. Okay. All right, guys, I think that's about it. Um, you had a good time? I had a good time. Well, I'm happy to have you guys here, right? Um, what should I buy next? I don't know. Right. All right, guys. I think that's about it. We're gonna end the live today. All right, Brian, bro. Um, we're gonna we're gonna call it a day. How you doing? How you doing? Um, Thank you, gang. All right. Special thanks to Brian for coming down over here. Boosted RC. When you see him in the streets, say hello. And if you have any nitros that you want fixed give them just send them yeah just send them just send them send them back it's to armor send them it's back free. to armor you know uh you, you know i have an armor right now at home put it back in the box put it like far away in a closet the utility closet unless like one of my fuses blow i ain't gonna go look at it you know nitro gang goodbye everyone, okay gotta go uh, go do stuff now okay melissa says good night hey hey we don't imitate shootings messed up messed up bro Bye, 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 guys. Cut, cut, and print. Okay.